The United States says it is ready to begin processes to remove Sudan from the list of terror sponsor states. The U.S. State Department said Tuesday this underlines its commitment to international standards against fighting terrorism. Sudan that has, uh, has settled all the outstanding uh, claims in, uh, in the United States and fully compliant uh, on North Korea is a Sudan that will be much better positioned internationally than it is right now. The presence of Sudan on the terror list means banks and international institutions are reluctant to guarantee commercial transactions with the country. Sudan has welcomed the development. Khartoum is expected to improve its human rights situation and resolve internal conflicts as part of an undertaking in the fight against terrorism. Washington put Sudan on the blacklist in 1993, accusing it of supporting extremist Islamist groups. Al-Qaeda's founder Osama bin Laden lived in the country between 1992 and 1996.